You know, I hate to be so negative, but this guy deserves every last boo he gets here tonight. Man, I can't wait to see these two square off in one-on-one -on -one action. This is a one-on-one -on -one matchup, and I don't think I have to remind anyone what's on the line here. And John Cena's in complete control. Quick thinking to avoid that. Uh-oh. Watching this beating, we can only wonder what kind of attack is next. If I were this guy, I'd stick with this attack. What do you think about John Cena? I have to say, when I think back on all the epic matches I've seen and been a part of in WWE, for pure entertainment value, John Cena's match against our friend JBL <laughs> at Judgment Day 2005 might have topped them all. I mean, that was a grudge match of epic proportions. The sky's the limit. I see a lot of main events in the future. Complete control. Whoa. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. Two. John Cena with the offense. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything Three. can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all can be used to cause massive damage. The moment in WWE history that you just brought up, King, right. John Cena's win in the main event at Judgment Day 2005 Five. was one of the roughest, toughest matches in the annals of wrestling. Right. You know, our friend Six. John may have come out on the wrong end of it, but yeah. you, I am sure, take pride in just having been a part of it. Oh, you're right, Michael. That was some match. And I know JBL likes to make excuses and still tells people he was sick that day. But you know what? I don't think that would have made one lick of difference. Nothing was going to stop John Cena that night. He wants this battle decided inside the ring. And that's why he's Six. such a great athlete, such a, an important superstar. This guy's kicks are so impactful. Ow! Ooh. Well, we're on the move here. Hey, now! Two. Anytime we have John Cena in the ring, Michael, I can't help but think of the most memorable matches Three. he's given us over the years and what were some of the biggest events WWE has ever staged. Four. I mean, maybe none bigger than his win over Edge at Unforgiven in 2006. He turned the wrestling world on its ear that night. Not today, too fast. Look at the attack here. Oh man, talk about a direct hit. Makes the cover. Looking to be in great physical condition here, almost impervious to pain. Once the bat goes, it's nearly impossible to stand, let alone deliver any offense. The event we just brought up, Unforgiven in 2006, really was a benchmark in John Cena's career. It wasn't just that he won Edge's championship in front of Edge's hometown fans, it was the way he did it giving the champ an attitude adjustment from the top of a 16-foot ladder just before he claimed the title. That's probably something we'll never see again. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. <laughs> You're right about that. You gotta remember what works. Where did this explosion of offense come from? He's in full-on attack mode now. Nearly driven through the map. 
We were talking about the unbelievable. Styles got it. Man, Styles might just win this one right here, Cole. The shoulders are down. Two. There's a drop kick. These are great competitors, great, tremendous gladiators here in WWE. Some of the best superstars that WWE have to offer. Oh, that might have realigned the spine permanently. Even if you can get back to your feet after a move like that, at this stage of the match, you're still struggling to find your balance. And John Cena gains momentum in this match. Well, when you look at the illustrious career of John Cena starting way back in 2002, and since then, 21 championships. An astounding accomplishment and never a dull moment. Oh, you're right about that. And don't forget the 15 world championships. 11, that's it. He's out. John Cena makes the cover. And the thing about John Cena that stands out, only Bob Backlund and Bruno San Martino, four days combined as WWE Champion. In the 11 reigns as WWE Champion, we were just talking about, that, folks, is a WWE record. That's it. He's done. Now that's a finishing move. This thing might be all. This should do it right there. I think this is it. What a shot. Hoping to end it early. Here's hoping. One, two. They can end it here. What right now? Two. Look at to catch him off guard. Quick round two. count. And into the cover. One, two. Quick pin. Hey, is this it? Uh, it may be. Two. As awful as it is to say at times, John Cena is such a domineering entity between these ropes. Right now, we're witnessing him assume full control of the contest. He's making a statement here with this attack. Styles got it. Man, Styles might just win this one right here, Cole. Taking on some moderate offense here. Going to need to start playing a little better defense. His shoulders are down. Two. Introduced by Chris Jericho back in 2005, the Money in the Bank ladder match has become one of the most anticipated matches on the WWE calendar. The shoulders are down. Two. Adding insult to potential injury there. I don't know if we've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy will try anything. Here we go. John Cena setting it up. Shoulders down. This one's not over yet. We've seen plenty of people come back from being in a lot worse shape. He's setting up. He's trying to fight back here. Can he do it? It 
it doesn't take a freaking genius to see that John Cena's John Cena is getting this match in gear at this point. A knockdown drag out brawl complete with a big stomp. And these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Here we go. Look at this. Here he comes. He's not done yet. Oh, no. He's here to fight. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Looking for the win. Styles got it. Man, Styles might just win this one right here, Cole. Makes the cover. The city of Boston has played host to some of sports entertainment's greatest moments, including the night Stone Cold Steve Austin captured the WWE Championship. Here we go. Here we go. He's hanging on for dear life. Can he score the pin? Two. Quick history lesson. John Cena in 2012 was the first superstar to unsuccessfully cash in his Money in the Bank contract. He's inflicting some serious pain here. Looks like the momentum is reversed here. He's got him hooked. Hey, this may very well be it. People have been wanting to see these guys go at it for a long time, and by the sound of this crowd, I think they're getting what they wanted. Ooh. Quick thinking to avoid that. Cena with a textbook counter. Yeah, you know, I know some people don't want to hear it, but the truth is, John Cena is so technically sound. Ooh, John Cena may have it. Oh, gosh. Hey, what do you want? Could this be it? I think so. Two, three. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. I can't believe what we saw in that match. We may be looking at the match of the year. Oh, they threw everything they had at each other in this match. Oh boy, that was a spectacular performance. Another win on the resume. If you're not feeling good about yourself after a win like that, you might have to get yourself checked. I think Boston is stunned by the outcome here, guys.